Roy is making tea. Just everything. Oh, Roy. Feed the bands. Feed the bands. Feed the bands. Every house should have a Roy. Look. He drinks the whiskey. <laughs> Preparing the Brussels. We're having. Um, what are we having? What is pork, it? Pork, roast pork. Yeah, what, no, what is it though? Um, yeah, we're having pork. a roast pork tonight from our own pigs and onions from our Big Roy's own garden. I didn't grow any. And I'd like to say we grew potatoes, but we didn't. We got them reduced to £1.29 from co-op. Joan's telling me. Don't I, waste the tape, I'll save those the pigs. No, they won't. We're talking about pig squill, and I can't show you them because they won't let me. <clears throat> but June says there used to be a pig squill van came to school. Yeah, it used to come to the back of the school, the canteen, to collect the food, the leftover food at the end of the day. And it was a pig squill van. Well, it was pigs. stunk. Well, they just mixed it all together. Yeah, but I think it came quite frequently, so it really have time. Tracy's grandmother used to say, I'm embarrassed. And, yeah. and collect. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Yeah. It's a revelation, kids. Quite commonplace, I think, for... Until foot of mouth. Until foot of mouth, then it wasn't so long, That was the South African airliner uh, with food, allegedly. Mm. Mm. This is a podcast episode in itself. From pig <laughs> Maybe if people were like, look, <laughs> I could put them on the camera, it'd be great. We could talk about pig swill, um, army barracks, long town, you know, that kind of thing. Roy is just trying out the new um, that. Oh my god, I'm so good. See that precision? Precision. Okay. Oh, that's a fancy impeller propeller. What's the difference? I should lift out there. What's the difference? Can anyone tell me? Huh? Huh? Can you envisage it now? I get sheep hurdles and I bar off the, you know, the little passageways with the gates that they walk through. I bar them off just on the off chance that one decides that it's hungry, thirsty, whatever, and it wants to hop on through them barriers. Thank you for my potato delivery, John Clark. <laughs> Give me a window. A window? I don't like plans. I'm more of a wing it kind of person, but this is millimetre perfect. Go with there. I can hold that. <laughs> no, no. There. Yeah. My mark not good enough for you. Me and Roy have come to Hogs to get some sand. Sand. Everyone at the minute is using sand. Now that is a beast of a JCB. <laughs> it makes Joe Seals look like a Tonka toy. That's big. That thing that you just saw there, excuse for his bad reversing, um, it is the same price as a 535.95, which is what Joe Seals has got, but the Agrispec one. 
95 grand. That's an awful lot of money. But that one there only booms out six meters. It's just got one, you know, like one telescopic bit, whereas Joe's booms out to nine meters. But it is an absolute beast of a machine. It probably does only do 20 k as I just said, as well. But like, all it's doing is loading wagons. It's a different thing, isn't it? Like, Joe's sat on his going around the yard, mucking out, doing this, that, and the other. That one is literally going, loading, going and loading. But yeah, just price of things. You put Agri in front of anything and it just becomes automatically more expensive. So we have just been to get sand. Sorry I missed it. I thought he'd do more than one bucket and I'd be able to catch it, but the bucket's that big, he just did one. <laughs> We live that close to the concrete yard. Like the ladder, the building ladder who's building, the building ladder who's building said, do you want to take my, you know, pick up with the trailer on? I'm like, but what's the point? Because the concrete yard's that close. It doesn't take that long in the tractor. It's literally taking us, what, 15 minutes to go and come back. Excuse me, get out. Oh, you've trashed the gate. Who knew she could be so disruptive? Them things on the floor there, they're piles. And we had them from the garage. Gary's making me like, um, just irrelevant. Just going busy myself. With housework or something. Um, yeah, them piles. I'm not even joking, I am like, I'm wandering around aimlessly because there's somebody here doing the bits that I would be doing, like helping. Ooh! I am being sent with a shopping list to Greyrig um, to care for Allenby's. And by the time I get back, they'll have done all the interesting stuff. Like, this is actually distressing me. So we have just got in the car. I tell you something, Kendall's rainy. <laughs> we're not really in Kendall, we're sort of like where are we? Grey Rig, so it's cold. It's like on the back road to Kendall from our house. Um, we've just been to Lakeland Pipes and we've been coming here for well years to be honest since we moved to the farm and we did the lane and we got some of funnily enough that twin wall right next to us there and we twin walled all the way down the middle of the lane and we made manholes and then we cambered the lane in sort of like a dish so that the water runs down the middle of it goes in and then drains underneath because when we first moved to our house there was a river down the middle of the lane literally there was a dip like a, a hole cut out and the river used to go down the middle of the lane and it was that scary to drive down, according to Auntie Anne, she used to park at the top. <laughs> yes. Yep. You're fine. Tell you what, these lads could build a house in not long, couldn't they? I bet they could build a house in a week. That's crazy. Look at my window. Do you like my window? Love my window. This is my dairy. Hello. This is my storeroom, and here there will be a staircase going up there. It's very exciting. My cows are being stupid. Seriously, they're being stupid, they're being naughty. The gallivanting, like, herring around the shed like idiots. I don't know why, I don't know what they're doing. There is a ringleader, there is a ringleader. So <clears throat> we're outside, we've been road tripping today to pick up pipes and such like and it's raining and my spouting's come off. 
I'm gonna get a wet hand, aren't I? It's not exactly fixed, but yeah. Me and Caroline Rain, Lady Rain. <laughs> Lady Rain, who doesn't work for NFU anymore? Tell everyone who where you work. I work for myself. She works for herself. She's a royal boss. She basically sits around all day in her pajamas. Yeah, in my spare room. <laughs> a Cumbria rural. That's what I am now. <laughs> Classy. No, she doesn't. She does all paperwork and stuff. You know that stuff that we don't like doing. Stewardship. You know, stewardship stuff. Very professional. Yeah, stewardship Just, and yeah. you know SFI. Yeah. And all the things that people need help with nowadays. Yeah. Here I am. Caroline is here to offer a helping hand in these situations. But I just wanted to show you actually, not just pimping her. <laughs> I feel a little bit sick. Look how high up we are. What? That's crazy, we're on the 13th floor. What's that way? Is there a window over there? Let's run along this corridor. Oh, I'm gonna leave it here because we are going to the National Football Museum in Manchester. We are at the Agri Leader Forum. Big football fans. Massive football fans. <laughs> Might be interesting. No, go with an open heart and an open mind. We could learn something. Okay. Just looking what's in here. Right outside. Oh no, that's really weird. Oh no. Mm. Is there like a cleaning? Oh, there's a man there cleaning. That's really tell we've gone to the city. Continue my very interesting video about the aggregated forum tomorrow, but for now, I'll love you and leave you. Thank you so much for watching. As always, I appreciate you. Love you long time. See you next time. So back out there. Bye. I'll get Siobhan in my video, so I'm Hello. redoing the ending and I'm doing it again and you're gonna watch it again because I don't actually have time to edit it because we're sat in the middle of a hotel lobby. <laughs> but I never even get a photo with Siobhan, so I thought I'd get a picture and a video of everything with her inside. We've got a video, we can keep this. So when I ring you at Christmas and say, I'm doing a montage, can I have a photo? We can I'll take screenshots. So yeah, thanks very much for watching. Love you long time. See you Bye. next time. Bye.